This is Dabu7 with some updates and some field test results here that may shock some people. And this is a follow-up to the video I put out yesterday in regards to Pastor Steve down near Tucson, Arizona, talking about these alleged cell towers, the G-Ball surveillance systems, and all that good stuff. Well, we have some subscribers that actually went out to one of these new towers. They actually confronted one of the guys on the ground. They discovered that it was ran by Verizon, but yet... Although they are Verizon customers, they could not pick up any bit of a better signal standing right underneath this tower. They ran some tests. I want to share it with you guys. It just goes to show the exact same thing that Pastor Steve said, that with these new towers up that are running, it's not amplifying the signal. So what are they there for? What's all the electrical stuff for them? That huge electrical box? Oh, that one is a generator for backup power. Yep. So he admits it's a generator. Towers all across this country. All of a sudden, these have their own walls around them. Pictures of it, too. And you just heard him tell me what it was, supposedly. I'll leave a link so you guys can watch this. Make sure to subscribe to Gina's channel. I'm not sure what this little thing is here sticking up. Caution. That's a little bizarre. Portable bathrooms where they're working on it. But she takes a peek inside and shows us that sure enough they have nice brand new generators, diesel generators sitting in here. Says it's a Verizon wireless antenna. I have Verizon. And as you can see, it says this is a Verizon station. You can see all the numbers and identification, but their tests are going to show you otherwise. You can hear everything running. You can hear stuff running. It is operational. Okay, it's got its own backup generator. And now we'll go to some of the tests that they conduct. Let me see your phone. How many bars do you have? Because it says right here. Whoa, I zoomed in. Hold on. I have two. You see right there? Two right It says it's a Verizon. Verizon tower. I have Verizon. Two bars. Yeah, there's no way. I have two. I just had one bar. It's a Verizon tower that's finished. Just finished. We get our services crap and we have Verizon. We're out in front and we're doing a Wi-Fi test. Oh, that was bad. Now pay attention to where the towers are on her map. I don't know. Can you go back to the one where it shows that the... It has all of the stuff right here. I know that the closest Wi-Fi is fries, the or the closest the closest hot signal hot signal. Hold on, Verizon signal. There's Here where they're at, and look. The closest ones were right here, where it's supposed to be, and the closest ones away from are us. away from them. We're right here. Yeah, and we are right here underneath the tower. And as and you can see, they are the right there underneath the tower, and it's operational. Their signals are weak. And it's the exact same thing we saw in the situation that Pastor Steve was explaining. So this is now two different locations. Now you have visual proof of them not picking up any better quality of a signal. And the map is not even registering this one. Yet it is running operational. And it was the same thing going on with Pastor Steve's. Up operational but yet no one's getting a signal, so the question is still the same. What are they being used for? And no doubt, you're going to go out there and there's going to be certain ones that are used as a cell phone tower, but we've shown time and time again with all these technologies, and if you missed the other video, make sure to check it out, the one before this. We talk about and show exactly what they're doing in multiple cities, Seattle, Chicago. They have shown and even talked about these in the mainstream media on occasion showing proof that there are fake cell towers 
in places like Chicago, Cincinnati, and in other cities. So one of the best ways we know right now to try to weed out the real from the fake here is to simply look and see who's running it, find someone that has that service, go near it, and if your signal isn't getting boosted, I think it should say it all. So there's some more evidence. Wanted to share it with you guys. I'll leave a link in the description box. Keep you guys posted with more as I come across it. It's been Dabu 7.